hello everyone in this video we are going to solve a little tricky arithmetic problem simple arithmetic problem but it is quite tricky uh, so the problem is given here a plus b plus a b is an identity which is equal to 290 okay then what is the value of a plus b okay so it seems very easy problem but if you try to calculate this will uh, be really complicated okay so if you don't believe this problem then pause the video and try it on your own and basically do the calculation to find a plus b value of a plus b from the expression a plus b plus a b equal to 290 okay so otherwise we shall move on uh, this there is a trick and unless you know the trick it it may be difficult to solve this problem right away okay anyway so the problem given is here a plus b plus a b equal to 290 and we want to calculate the value of a plus b okay so if you just uh, think uh, of uh, think of it uh, for a moment uh, you will get some trivial solutions like what like you can take a to be 290 and b to be 0 so then a plus b is what simply 290 okay there is another solution also so slightly different but okay following this you can take a to be 0 and b to be 290 then also a plus b plus a b is 290 and then in this case also a plus b is 290 so is that the correct answer that okay in any any of the cases a plus b is going to be 290 first of all this is a wrong answer secondly this equation a plus b plus a b equal to 290 has infinitely many solutions so basically there will be infinitely many pairs of numbers uh, a comma b such that this identity holds okay let us see at least one more solution which is different from this okay these were trivial because one of them we took them to be trivial right now if we take a to be half simply and b to be 193 you can check that again this identity holds so basically half a equal to half b equal to 193 is also another solution okay but if you then then th there is a problem right because if in this case uh, you see a plus b is not at all uh, 290 so which one is the answer uh, the thing is that both of these answers 290 and this half plus 193 the value of a plus b <coughs> this is actually wrong answer to the problem why because we may have forgot uh, here a and b there is a restriction on a and b uh, what is that that a and b must be natural numbers which means what natural numbers means 1 2 3 4 5 and so on right but 0 unfortunately not a natural number and therefore since a and b they have to be natural number in the first solution here if you see a equal to 290 but b equal to 0 but the restriction is a b must be natural numbers b equal to 0 is not a natural number therefore this solution is not acceptable though this satisfies the equation secondly and similarly a equal to 0 b equal to 290 is not acceptable again because a equal to 0 is not a natural number okay for the same reason and what about in third case if you have a equal to half then half again is not a natural number and therefore we also cannot uh, actually uh, accept the third solution right so what is the solution we will see the trick and then uh, the problem is nothing actually well so the problem is a plus b plus a b equal to 290 what we will do now is uh, we will add 1 to both the sides then what it becomes a plus b plus a b plus 1 is 290 plus 1 okay so what it becomes if you simplify uh, on the right it is 291 but on the left it is a plus 1 into b plus 1 okay so basically now 291 must be equal to a plus 1 into b plus 1 now a is a natural number b is a natural number therefore a plus 1 is again a natural number b plus 1 is again a natural number and then how to write 291 as a product of two natural numbers and each of them are at least two right because a is a natural number b is a natural number then a b are at least one okay so one case we have discarded because if a plus one is one or b plus one is one then a b will be zero right so a b zero case we cannot expect uh, we cannot uh, we have seen actually why uh, 
a and b a and b zero will not give a solution well so then how to factor 291 so basically this is one uh, natural number this is another natural number which are different from one and 290 that their product is 290 okay so now can we write 290 as a product of two numbers and guess from there what are the values of a and b well so what is 291 okay how can you write this well can you guess any of the factors of 291 which means any number which divides 291 okay so if you just add the digits of the number 291 so basically 2 plus 9 plus 1 that gives us uh, 12 right so 12 is divisible by 3 and therefore the number 291 must be divisible by 3 so at least one factor we have found out that is 3 well so then if you divide it by, divide it by 3 then what is the quotient okay so what is the remaining number 3 into one can easily check that the remaining number is 97 now there is something interesting so 3 is gone and remaining is 97 but 97 is again a prime and therefore there is no other factors and there is no other factor you can also write in this way 97 into 3 but there is no other factorization okay so 291 has this unique expression okay as product of natural numbers except uh, this one of them is one okay so 291 is 3 into 97 or 97 into 3 there is no other 1 into 90 1 into 291 case will not come again because that will imply either a or b is 0 so uh, now a plus 1 into b plus 1 is 291 so basically a plus 1 is a number you can just say x y capital x capital y x is a plus 1 y is b plus 1 their product is 291 now we have seen here the 297 291 can be written only in a single or let's say these two ways 3 into 97 97 into 3 so basically from here we should get a plus 1 is 3 b plus 1 is 97 or a plus 1 is 97 b plus 1 is 3 right so a plus 1 equal to 3 b plus 1 equal to 97 or this the first one is 97 second is 1 now you can check okay so this is the actually answer we have done it okay now if you check in both these cases simple calculation the value of a plus b is 98 and this is the only correct solution okay the others cannot be correct as we have explained okay. yeah so that's all in this video we have seen a tricky arithmetic problem if you like the content of this video do press the like button and consider subscribing our channel to uh, motivate us uh, i sincerely thank you for watching this video